In this video we will assemble the Y carriage. The Y axis is the one onto which the heated bed is mounted. So what you'll need is the heated bed. You'll need the ceramic fiber paper, the 25mm Kapton tape, the thick red wire which is cut into two pieces about 500mm each, the thermistor which is mounted to white wire and also some normal household silicon. Now that we've soldered the wires on, the heated bed looks like this. The one wire goes to contact number one and the other one to contact number two and three. The next step will be to tape the, th the thermistor onto the heated bed. How, we'll do, how we will do that is we'll place it in position and tape it with a 25mm Kapton tape to the heated bed. Now the heated bed should look something like this. The thermistor is taped nicely onto the bottom of the, the heated bed. The next step is to tape the rest of the, the heated bed with the capped on tape. The reason for this is it serves as a, th a thermal insulation to help you to heat the bed up quicker. And also after we've attached the ceramic fiber pipe with the silicon to the bed, if you want to remove the silicon later, it's, it's very easy to do that by just taking off the, the capped on tape. Okay, so now our heated bed looks like this. It's been covered with capped on tape all over. The next step is to glue the ceramic fiber paper with silicon to the heated bed. And we'll just add some, some silicon to the heated bed here and there. and then attach the ceramic fiber paper. Okay, once we're done, we can just cut off the corners so that the screws can come through. Okay, and that's it.